What's up you guys and welcome back to probably yours and my favorite series on my channel which is as you can see by the title recreating your guys' art and I truly love doing these videos because you guys are so talented and you have so many awesome ideas that for me it's just a pleasure to take my own spin on your guys' art and try to recreate it in my style so well as you can tell I'm super excited for today's video I can't wait to pick the drawing that I'm gonna be recreating and just one thing that I want to mention really quickly before before we jump into today's video is that for all of you guys that are new to my channel hi hello nice to have you here thank you so so much for supporting me and if you want to join our challenge if you want to join the fun then all you need to do is upload uh, the picture that you want me to redraw on your Instagram account make sure it's not private and then once you're uploading it then make sure you use the tag redraw this Natalia so in this manner I can uh, see and review all your submissions in one place so this is really convenient for me and I hope that it is convenient for you guys as well and also today's video is sponsored by Squarespace so whether you need your own domain your own website or an online store you can make it all with Squarespace and I guess now we're ready to jump straight into today's video and see what kind of drawings you sent my way and pick the one that I will be recreating today all right so firstly we're gonna review the redraw this Natalia hashtag I'm always taking recent and well I'm just going through all the submissions missions all of your art and I'm gonna see which one I will be recreating today and you guys there are so many awesome pieces that you create that it's almost heartbreaking for me to not be able to you know recreate all of your art but uh, I hope that in next episodes I'm actually gonna be able to do some more but just letting you know that I'm always so amazed by all of the art that you guys are creating it's literally awesome. And after a while, I finally decided which drawing I will be recreating today. And it's gonna be this one right here by Eerie Carey. I hope I'm pronouncing your name correctly. So first of all, I want to tell you why I picked this drawing and why it appealed to me this much. Firstly, the general composition and the vibe of the drawing are both super cool. It really gives me this kind of feeling of summer, which I desperately need at this moment. And then of course the color scheme. Is it only me or do you guys also feel like you've never seen those colors combined together before and now when you see them you're like, wow, they actually look so awesome together and you feel like you need to use them in your artworks as soon as possible? Well, I really feel this way and maybe this is why I actually picked this drawing because of its original color scheme, something really extraordinary for me. Lastly, obviously, the clothing. It really enhances both of the things that I've just talked about and I really love the cap and the colorful braids together. That's just something right up my alley. So guys, I really hope that you agree with me on all of those things because this artwork that I'm recreating today is just so cool to me and I like it so, so much. But even though I love the original drawing, it brought me quite some trouble when I started recreating it. This what you're seeing on the screen is actually my second attempt because the first one was too bad to finish it up so I gave up just after doing the sketch. But well, here we are again, I didn't give up totally and I'm glad that I decided to, you know, continue. So anyway, the problem that I'm talking about here that I had with this drawing is uh, the problem with the proportions. Since the original drawing is quite squeezed into the shape of the paper, and I hope you're understanding what I'm uh, trying to say by that, it's really essential to execute the proportions really well. So the head is not too big in comparison to the shoulders and the shoulder area is not too broad. So honestly, here is where I had some trouble with figuring out the good proportions and the good composition of the whole drawing, but I think that eventually the proportions and the composition is looking quite okay. Let me know what do you guys think. And now for the things that I altered. I wanted to give this drawing a little bit more of playfulness and fun feeling, so first of all I decided to turn this girl's head a little bit to the left, to our left, not to her left, so it seems like she's looking to the back, like she's noticed someone. And then to make the drawing even more dynamic, I changed the shoulder situation to be a bit more diagonal and asymmetric, so one of the shoulder is higher than the other one. And here is actually a good trick to make your drawing a little bit more lively and dynamic, like I said. 
Uh, try to have your composition a little bit more diagonal as opposed to horizontal or vertical. This is in fact a really good way to throw some life, let's say, into your compositions. And lastly, for the clothing, I stick to the original idea. I just changed the color of the cap and I made the print on it a little bit thicker. And also I changed the braid style and uh, well, that would be pretty much it for the clothing changes. And here's where I want to thank Yuri once more for sending your work. I truly loved it and I really hope that you like my version too. You better turn up You better be there when I shake Watch me rockin' if I can't stop If I should fall, just go ahead Go and catch me, baby And now it's a great time to talk a little bit about designing my new website with Squarespace. I'm not any web designer, so I need a platform that will provide me with a really easy access to a variety of super easy tools to create my website. There are plenty of options of how you can arrange your site, so I bet you guys won't have any problems with designing it. I mean, I did it with my zero experience, so I really think it's super easy. And not only that, Squarespace offers so many beautiful templates that you can choose from, the variety is just totally amazing. So if you want to give Squarespace a go, head over to squarespace.com slash nataliamade and sign up for a free trial and with my code nataliamade you can get 10% off your first purchase. So guys, just check it out!
All right, and that wraps up my recreating my followers video. These are my true favorites on my channel and I hope you guys are enjoying them as much as I do. And to those of you that are submitting your art to my Instagram hashtag, I just want to say huge thank you. I truly appreciate that. And I hope that you know that I wish I could squeeze all of your drawings into my videos, but it's too many of them. So it's just impossible, but I truly love all of them and uh, just please don't be sad if your drawings uh, don't make it into my videos. It doesn't mean that they are bad or anything, it's just like impossible to squeeze them all. So I hope you guys understand that. So well, I'll be wrapping up for now. Thank you guys so so much for watching again and uh, I hope you're having an amazing day and I can't wait to see you in my next videos. Take care guys, bye! I'm just going with the gut, never had a doubt, felt like this is just a must Put me in perspective, I'm the deepest in the cut, everybody tuning in, but this is just for us now